Hi everyone, I hope that this video finds you safe and healthy at home with your families. I'm so grateful I get to guide you through a flow today. This flow is going to be all about unlocking the hips, really opening through the lower half of our bodies, really opening up through our hips. So we are going to start standing at the back of our mat. So just slowly making your way there. Planting the feet on the ground, underneath your hips. Letting the arms just settle at your side. And then closing through the eyes. Allowing yourself to start to engage with the other senses that you have available. Really starting to picture yourself standing at the back of your mat. Beginning to create that little bit of proprioception, acknowledging where you are against the ground, where you are in the space and air around you. Maybe starting to lift all 10 toes off of the ground, spreading them wide, and then slowly releasing them back on the mat one at a time, keeping that little bit of space in them. Shifting weight into the outside edges and the heels of your feet, feeling that little bit of air in the arches of your feet. Finding a slight tuck of the tailbone, allowing the glutes, the quads, the hamstrings to slightly engage. And using an inhale, draw the shoulders up towards your ears. And then open mouth, exhale, just let them glide down your back, letting the palms start to shine forward to the top of the mat. And slightly tucking the chin, lifting the crown of the head towards the ceiling, growing a little taller. And once you've found this stillness, the strength in this posture, Starting to recognize your breath, noticing how before your practice it was probably a super subtle movement through you that you barely even noticed. But as you stand here still, you're noticing how big and expansive that breath can be. Starting to draw that air in and out through the nostrils. Making each inhale and exhale a little longer and a little fuller. Maybe your next inhale, reaching the hands up overhead. Exhale, draw the shoulders down. Use an inhale, find length. And then keeping the space between your palms, exhale, bend the elbows, drawing the hands in line with your head. Inhale, reach back up, lengthen through the arms. Exhale, bend the elbows, hands in line with your head. Inhale, re-extend, long through the fingertips. Exhale, bend through the elbows, drawing your hands in line with your head. Inhale, find the length. Exhale, bend the elbows, hands in line with your head. Last one, inhale, extend through the fingertips, reach down through the heels, and then exhale, bend the elbows, hands in line with your head. Inhale, lengthen through the hands, reach up overhead, draw the hands together, and then exhale, pull them down through heart center, letting the palms press against your chest. Feeling that blood flow through your arms, through your chest, and the energy and breath moving through you. And use an inhale, sweep the arms back up overhead. And then exhale, just lift the eyes, peeking through the fingertips. Inhale, draw the head back to neutral. Exhale. Right arm down, left arm reaches up and over. Bumping the left hips over to the left, reaching long.
along through the left fingertips. Planting down through the outside edge of that left foot. Inhale draws you back to center. Exhale, left arm down, right arm reaches up and over. Focusing on breathing through that right rib cage, letting it separate that fascia and lengthen you through the right side body. Inhale, draws you back to center. Exhale, bend at the elbows, draw them back behind you, lifting the eye gaze. Inhale, reach the arms up. Exhale, right arm down, left arm reaches up and over. Inhale, back to center. Exhale, left arm down, right arm reaches up and over. Inhale, back to center. Exhale, cactus through the arms. Draw the elbows back, the chest shines forward. Inhale, reach back up. Exhale, right arm down, left arm reaches up and over. Inhale, arms reach up overhead. Exhale, left arm down, right arm up and over. Inhale, drawing back to center. Exhale, hinge at the hips, forward fold. Letting your head hang heavy here, maybe bending for the knees. Finding a grip that feels good, maybe interlacing the hands behind your skull or grabbing onto opposite elbows. Letting yourself sway and shift side to side. As each breath lets the hips lift a little higher and the head sink just a little bit lower. Just draining here, letting the breath flow easy through you. Starting to release whatever hand grip that you took. Walk the hands out in front of you all the way to the top of your mat, finding your high plank, really pressing through the palms, high on the toes, crown of the head reaching forward. Use an inhale, drop the chest down in between the shoulders, squeezing the shoulder blades back together. And then exhale, press away from the ground, creating that dome sensation in the top of your back. Inhale, find length through the top of your head. Exhale, drop the knees down to the ground. Untuck the toes and send the hips back to meet the heels, finding your child's pose. Using an inhale, start to pull yourself forward, drawing your chest in between your shoulders, letting the belly button drop. Exhale, press away from the palms, round and curl, hips to heels. Inhale, pulls you forward, chest drawing through, hips lowering slightly towards the ground. Exhale, round and curl, tuck the tailbone, chin towards your chest, child's pose. This time maybe pulling all the way through, inhaling into your cobra, letting the hips drop, letting the eye gaze lift, shoulders pulling back behind you. Exhale, press away from the ground, rounding, curling through the spine. Child's pose. Inhale, pulls you forward, finding that tabletop position, stacking the hands underneath the shoulders, the knees underneath the hips. Use an inhale, send the left leg back behind you, heel in line with the hip. Exhale, bend the left leg, drawing the heel towards your glute, pointing the toes or lifting through the heel. Inhale, draw the toes towards the crown of the head. Exhale, round and curl, drawing left knee towards your nose. Inhale, reach back up, hammock through the low belly and spine. Exhale, round and curl, knee to nose. Inhale, left leg lifts, eye gaze lifts. Exhale, round and curl, knee to nose. Pressing through the palms, create that space. Then place that left foot in between your hands. Inhale, biceps in line with your ears. Exhale, hips sink forward, fingers trace back. Inhale, back to center. Exhale, straighten through the left leg, hold over that left leg, half splits. Inhale, draws you all the way up. Exhale, hips sink forward, eye gaze lifts. 
Inhale, back to center. Exhale, half splits. Inhale, draws you all the way up. Biceps in line with your ears. Exhale, hold over that left leg. Plant the hands, send the left foot back behind you. Heel in line with the hip. Dropping the toes to the ground. Pivoting the right foot out behind you. And then inhale, lift the left arm up towards the sky. Finding your modified side plank. Exhale, feel the space as you press away from the ground. And then inhale, left leg long towards the top of your mat. Exhale, open the chest towards the ceiling, letting the hips drop underneath you. Inhale, back to center. Exhale, left hand down. Left knee meets the right. Finding some hip circles here. Maybe just shifting back and forth into child's pose. Maybe even a few cat-cows. Just letting yourself lubricate through the joints and your wrists, your hips, your knees. And then finding that neutral tabletop. And inhale, left, right leg back behind you, heel in line with your hip. Exhale, bend the knee, drawing that heel towards your glute. Inhale, lift the eye gaze, toes towards the crown of your head. Exhale, round and curl, right knee towards your nose. Inhale, lift it back, hammocking through that low belly. Exhale, round and curl, eat a nose. Inhale, kick the leg back, let the eye gaze lift. Exhale, round and curl, knee to nose. Pressing through the hands, place the right foot in between your hands. Inhale, biceps in line with your ears. Exhale, sink the hips forward. Ivy's lifts. Inhale, back to center. Exhale, straighten through the right leg, fold over that leg. Half splits. Inhale, biceps in line with your ears. Exhale, let the hips sink forward. Fingers reach back. Inhale, back to center. Exhale, straighten through the right leg. Fold over that leg. Inhale, all the way back up. Exhale, fold you over that right leg, planting the hands in the ground. Sending the right foot back behind you. Dropping the right toes on the ground. Then pivoting that left foot off to the side. Inhale, right arm reaches up. Modified side plank. Exhale, settles you. Inhale, right fingertips reach forward. Exhale, spiral open towards the ceiling. Inhale, back to center. Exhale, right arm down, right knee down. Taking a moment, finding those cat cows, those hip circles, shifting side to side, or just finding a child's pose. And when you're ready, finding that tabletop position. Starting to tuck the toes underneath. Use an inhale, press the ground away, knees come to hover. Exhale, send the hips up and back, down dog. Pedaling out through the feet. Maybe bending both knees towards the chest, lifting the hips towards the sky. And then slowly starting to release the heels down, slightly pigeon-toed. So you can really fan through the hip bones. Breathing here, feeling the opening in the back of the legs, the lengthening in the spine. Use an inhale, lift the left leg high behind you. Bend the left knee and then make some hip circles with that left leg. Drawing the knee down towards the earth and then letting it point up towards the sky making them as big or small as you want. Really feeling the isolation in that left hip as you press down through the right leg and the hands. And inhale, sends the left leg long. Exhale, draw the knee towards the nose, high on the right toes. Inhale, lift it back behind you, three-legged dog. Exhale, knee to nose, hold here. Gently place the left foot in between the hands. 
Inhale, biceps in line with your ears, crescent lunge. Exhale, settles you. Inhale, find length. Exhale, twist to the left, left arm reaching back, right arm reaching forward. Inhale, here. Exhale, right hand down, left arm reaching up towards the sky. Use an inhale, sweep that left hand across the top of your mat. Exhale, reach it back up. Inhale, draws it across, reaching. Exhale, lifts you back up. Inhale, sweep it across, reaching towards the right. Exhale, reach it back up. Use an inhale, press back through the right heel, feeling length in the hamstring. And then exhale, left hand frames that left foot. Starting to walk hand over hand, pivoting on that right foot, finding a wide-legged forward fold towards the right side of your mat. So letting your head hang heavy, sending the hips up towards the ceiling. Toes maybe drawing slightly in, pressing out through the heels. Knees shifting side to side, bending one knee and then the other, doing a little dance with your hips. Just breathing here, letting the hips reach up, letting the low back release, the head reach down. And then straightening through the legs, releasing any hand grips that you took, walking hand over hand back to the top of your mat, framing that left foot with your hands. Inhale, send the left leg up and back, three legged dog. Exhale, down dog. Inhale, right leg lifts long. Exhale, bend that right leg, drawing the heel towards the glute. Finding some hip circles here with the right leg. Really opening that knee towards the ceiling, drawing it back down. And then switching directions. Feeling the opening, the hip flexors, the psoas glute. And using an inhale, square off your legs, right leg lifts. Exhale, knee to nose. Inhale, right leg lifts back, three-legged dog. Exhale, knee to nose. Place the right foot at the top of your mat. Inhale, biceps in line with your ears, crescent lunge. Exhale, let the shoulders settle down. Use your next exhale, twisting to the right, right fingertips reaching back, left fingertips reaching forward. Use an inhale, find length through your spine. And then exhale, left hand down, right arm reaches up. Inhale, sweeps that right arm to the left. Exhale, reach through the right fingertips. Inhale, draws it across. Exhale, reach long through the fingertips. Open up. Inhale, draws it across to the left, reaching. Exhale, right hand reaches up. Find an inhale of length here. Exhale, right hand comes down. Walking hand over hand, this time to the left. Toes pointing towards the left side of your mat. Finding your wide-legged forward fold. Finding something different this side, or maybe the same thing. Maybe you want to walk the hands out slightly. Pressing the palms into the ground, making down dog arms, and then pushing back through the hips. And then slowly drawing yourself back underneath, walking hand over hand, right toes pointing to the top of the mat. Inhale, lifts the right leg back behind you, three-legged dog. Exhale, down dog. Inhale, left leg lifts, long behind you. Exhale, knee to nose. Inhale, left leg lifts, long. Exhale, knee to nose. Place that left foot in between the palms of your hands. Inhale, crescent lunge. Exhale, shoot the fingertips forward, hovering the upper body on that left thigh. 
Then pressing through that left leg, draw the right knee up and through, finding your one-legged Tadasana. Starting to draw the hands down through heart center, tucking through the tailbone. And then pivoting that leg so you can draw that right ankle on top of that left quad. Finding your figure four. Staying here. We're slowly starting to bend through that left knee, dropping the hips down, finding your one-legged chair. Really drawing the right toes towards your shins, letting that right knee actively press down, opening through the right hip. Inhale, start to lengthen your back up. Releases that leg, finds your one-legged Tadasana. Hands reaching up overhead. As you exhale, start to pivot upper body forward as you reach that right leg long behind you, dropping the toes. Inhale, crescent lunge. Exhale, let the fingers strip back behind you. Inhale, bring it forward. Exhale, start to pivot on that right foot, toes pointing towards the right edge of your mat, sitting down into your skandhasana. Okay. Inhale, sweep the arms forward, coming all the way back up into your crescent lunge. Exhale, let the eye gaze lift. Inhale, back to center. Exhale, hands drawing down through heart center, pointing the right toes to the back of the mat, skandhasana. Inhale, sweep the arms forward, all the way up into your crescent lunge. Exhale, settles you. Use an inhale, reach the fingertips towards the top of your mat. Exhale, hands plant down on the ground. Inhale, left leg lifts up and back, three-legged dog. Exhale, down dog. Inhale, right leg lifts. Exhale, knee to nose. Inhale, right leg lifts, long behind you, three-legged dog. Exhale, knee to nose, make the room. Place that right foot in between the hands. Inhale, crescent lunge. Exhale, start to reach the fingertips forward as you press off into that right leg, drawing the left leg up and through. One-legged Tadasana. Starting to draw the hands down through heart center. And then pivoting that left leg, drawing the ankle on top of that right quad. Staying here. We're starting to bend through the right knee, drawing the hips down towards the earth, finding that one-legged chair, opening through the left hip, feeling strength in the right hamstring, glute, and quad. Use an inhale, lengthening through that right leg, drawing the left knee back into your one-legged Tadasana, hands reaching up overhead, then pivoting the upper body forward, reaching the left leg back behind you, planting the toes. Inhale, crescent lunge. Exhale, eye gaze lifts, chest reaches up. Inhale, back to neutral. Exhale. Drawing the hands through heart center, pivot on the left foot, pointing to the corner of your mat, finding skandhasana. Inhale, sweep the arms forward, pointing towards the top of your mat, crescent lunge. Exhale, hips sink forward, eye gaze lifts. Inhale, back to center. Exhale, pivoting on that left foot, drawing down into your skandhasana. Inhale, sweep the arms forward, pointing towards the top of your mat, Exhale, crescent lunge. Inhale, fingertips reach forward, hovering the upper body. Exhale, hands plant. Inhale, right leg lifts up and back, three-legged dog. Exhale, down dog. Inhale, left leg lifts high. Exhale, left knee, left tricep. Inhale, left leg lifts high. Exhale, left knee, left tricep, and then slowly planting that left foot to the outside edge, 
of that left hand. Shifting weight into the left foot, drawing the right foot to the outside of the right leg. And drawing your hands to heart center, so your elbows on the inside of your knees, hips are still high. Use an inhale, find the length of the crown of your head. Exhale, sink the hips down a little bit. Inhale, lifts the hips. Exhale, draws them down a little bit more. Inhale, lift the hips. Exhale, draws them down, coming all the way into your malasana. Toes pointing towards the corners of your mat. Tailbone drawing down towards the ground. Crown of your head lifting up. Really using the strength on the inside of your thighs against your arms to separate through those knees. Allowing the hips to open a little bit more. Slowly planting your hands back on the ground. Lifting the hips up. Send the right foot to the back of the mat. And then inhale, lift the left leg long behind you, three-legged dog. Exhale, down dog. Inhale, right leg lifts long. Exhale, right knee, right tricep. Inhale, left leg long. Exhale, right knee, right tricep. Hold it here, placing that right foot at an angle on the outside of that right leg. And then slowly drawing that left foot to the outside of the left palm. And then slowly lowering, once again, into your malasana. This time, Planting the hands down, maybe fingertips touching on top of your mat. And starting to reach the right arm back behind you, opening up to the right. Drawing it back to center. Inhale, left hand reaches up. Exhale, open it back behind you. Inhale, left arm reaches up. Exhale, releases. Drawing the hands back through heart center. Finding just a little bit more depth. Just a few more breaths. And releasing the hands down on the mat. Beginning to place the left foot to the back of the mat. Drawing the right foot up and back, three-legged dog. Exhale, down dog. Inhale, left leg lifts high. Exhale, left knee, right tricep. Inhale, left leg lifts high behind you, three-legged dog. Exhale, left knee, right tricep. Hold it here. Extend the left leg long, reaching beyond your mat. And then slowly let that left hip lower all the way down to the ground. Drawing that right knee in slightly. And really drawing the left toes towards your face, contracting through that quad. Plant the palms on the mat. Inhale, reach the crown of the head forward, trying to square the shoulders to the top of the mat. Exhale, bend at the elbows, letting the head reach forward and down. Inhale, re-extend. Exhale, lower down. Inhale. Re-extend. Exhale, lower the head. Inhale, draws you back up. Good. Walking the hands forward slightly, starting to draw that left knee across the mat so the knee is next to your left wrist. Slowly starting to press back through the right leg, finding your pigeon pose. Inviting that right hip down to the ground. Really breathing here, trying to feel that opening in the left hip. Staying high, we're starting to draw the hands together in prayer. Inhale, reach the fingertips forward, pointing away from you. Exhale, press through the hip and allow yourself to open up, hovering that upper body on your hip. Inhale, press away, draws you back up. Exhale, 
lowers you down, hovering. Inhale, come all the way back up. Exhale, slowly lowers you all the way down. Head coming down to your fists, your forearms, or all the way down to the earth. Finding your pigeon. And really drawing back through that right leg. Feeling the opening in the outside of that left hip. Breathing here, closing through your eyes. Letting yourself just melt. Releasing tension in your back, in your toes. Just being here. Noticing any little spots that you're holding on to a little bit of tension. And seeing if you can just use an inhale to just contract in that area just for a moment. And then an exhale to just really release, melt in that little bit of area. And slowly, starting to draw yourself back up. Planting your hands underneath your shoulders, drawing the right toes under, and then inhale, lift the left leg long behind you, three-legged dog. Exhale, down dog. Inhale, right leg lifts long behind you, three-legged dog. Exhale, right knee, left tricep. Inhale, lift it back behind you long. Exhale, right knee, left tricep, hold it here. Extend that right leg to the outside of your mat, and then slowly release that right hip down to the ground. Drawing that left knee in, bending it, and then really drawing the toes towards your shin, feeling the quad contract here. Planting the palms on the ground, using an inhale. Square the shoulders, draw through the crown of your head. Exhale, find that knee push-up, hovering. Inhale, press away. Exhale, lower halfway down, reaching through the crown of your head. Inhale, press back. Exhale, lowering down. Inhale, presses you all the way back. Slowly, starting to draw that right knee in front of that right wrist. Extending the left leg long behind you, preparing for your pigeon. Using an inhale, draw the hands to heart center. Point them out in front of you. And then exhale, open up through the arms, hover the upper body against the thighs. Inhale, draws you back up. Exhale, hovers you. Inhale, push through the thigh, push through the outside edge of that knee. Come up. Exhale, lowers you all the way down. Finding your pigeon. Taking time to notice any sounds around you that can distract you or that can make this pigeon just feel a little bit less intense. Different sounds in your house. Your breath. Anything to just let you release a little bit more here. Seeing if you can find that little area that you're holding on to a little bit of tension. Seeing if you can focus on that space. And using an exhale to just release, sink a little bit more into the posture. Let yourself melt just a little bit more. Starting to rise up, placing the palms onto the mat, tucking the left toes under, and then inhaling the right leg along behind you, three-legged dog. Exhale, down dog. 
pedaling out through the legs, and slowly walking one foot in front of the other all the way to the top of your mat, forward fold. And taking the hands onto the ground, coming high onto the toes, drawing the heels up as you pull the glutes down towards the heels, rolling into a little ball. And slowly walking the hands out in front of you, letting the knees come down to the ground, finding this toe stretch here. So the toes are still tucked underneath. You feel a stretch in the arch of the feet and the toes. And settling here. Use an inhale, draw the hands up overhead. Exhale, bend the elbows, keeping the hands behind the skull. Use an inhale, draw the chest forward, elbow points reaching back. Exhale, close off, drawing the elbow points together, rounding, curling. Inhale, draws them apart, eye gaze lifts. Exhale, rounding, curling. Elbows drawing together. Inhale, elbows reach back, eye gaze lifts. Exhale, rounding, curling, elbows together, severing through the shoulder blades. Inhale, comes back to center. Exhale, right elbow reaches down, left elbow reaches up. Inhale, back to center. Exhale, left elbow down. Right elbow reaches up. Inhale, come back to center. Exhale, release the hands down to the ground. Untucking the toes, placing the hips back over the knees, and just pedaling out from the feet, tapping them on the ground, letting blood flow come back into the toes. And then slowly starting to shift over, either on your left hip or your right, so that you're facing the back of your mat. Planting your feet on the mat. And then at first, planting the left hand so that it's under your left shoulders and your fingers are pointing towards the top of your mat. Use an inhale, press through that left hand, lift the hips and reach the right arm across you, reaching towards the left side of you. Exhale. Release it down. Switching hands, pressing the right palm into the mat. Fingers pointing towards the top of the mat. Inhale, lift the hips, left arm reaching towards the right. Exhale, release it down. Good. This time taking both hands, planting them underneath the shoulders. Fingers pointing towards the bottom of your mat, so towards your hips, towards your toes. Okay. Using an inhale, lift the hips, lift the chest, feel that shoulder stretch, let the eye gaze reach up, squeezing through the glutes, opening through the front side of your body. Exhale, releases you all the way down, slowly extending out through the legs and lowering all the way down to the ground. For more you be finding a seated posture for your final Shavasana. Whatever feels most comfortable to you. And just starting to close through your eyes. Letting your breath come back to that supernatural effortless breath. Still feeling how expansive, how big, that breath really is. Giving yourself as long as you need here. Moments of silence, moments of stillness that we all especially need right now. I thank you so much for spending this time with me. Namaste.